McKenna, although I don't usually struggle to find words, finding the right ones to express how I feel today is difficult. We may not be perfect, but I'm reminded every day why you're the perfect man for me. All of my plans and rearranged them Now I finally know what amazing grace is When I look into your eyes Baby, I see my whole life What you say we put us down some roots Found a house up on a hill Travel around the world. When I was writing the service, I thought of Brand stopping by my office and telling me about McKenna and this newfound love for the first time. I remember how completely happy he was and how settled and sure he was. And after spending some time with McKenna, I know that she too is happy and settled and sure. McKenna and Brandt, we are all honored to be here today to celebrate your marriage. Every day I love you better than the day before Watch them sunsets fade from the front porch We'll build this home together with a rainy storm And as the years keep rolling on I'm forever thankful for you, for your never-ending support in whatever I want to do whether it's changing jobs or wanting to buy a motorcycle. You never try and stop me in my pursuit of whatever I want to do. You're my number one cheerleader, my partner in crime. I promise to love you for who you are and who you are yet to become. I promise to be patient and to remember that all things between us are rooted in love. I promise to nurture your dreams and help you reach them. I promise to share my whole heart with you and to remember to show you how deeply I care for you no matter the challenges that may come our way. I promise to love you loyally and fiercely as long as I shall live. Grant, I stand before you today sure of one thing, promising to love you for the rest of my life is by far the easiest decision I've ever made. <laughs> we may not be perfect, but I'm reminded every day why you're the perfect man for me. You motivate me, you ground me when I'm flying off the rails. You comfort me in times of need and laugh with me in times of joy. You love me through all of my flaws and make me feel safe in every aspect of life. You make me the best version of myself. I never knew what I was missing until you came into my life. You're the most incredible son, grandson, brother, dog dad, and just overall person. I'm so happy that after today I get to call you the best husband. I can't promise it will always be sunshines and rainbows, but I promise to give you the best of me every single day. I promise to always be your calm in the chaos, your light in the dark, and your best friend. I promise to never get mad when you come home with a new hat or get the itch for a new car. I promise to grow with you. I promise to challenge you. And I promise to stand with you and support your dreams, whatever they may be. Most importantly, I promise to love you until the day I die and somehow longer. You're everything to me, Brent Taylor Gordon, and I'm so excited to be your wife for the rest of my life. By the authority vested in me, I now pronounce that they are husband and wife. Therefore, what God has joined together let no person separate. You may kiss your bride. Then that time I went and said goodbye. Now I'm back and not ashamed to cry. Anyways, I knew Brad, I've known Brant for four or five years now. Uh, I work with him at the Sheriff's Office, and since I got signed off on my own, he was always somebody who's there who had questions with you know if they were wrong with the answers uh, with him. So, but I knew him before McKenna, and I can honestly say that since he's met her, he's been a happier man. The man he's become since her, I can only attribute to her. And from McKenna to you, I thank you for that. You've made him a happier man the way you've loved him. 
My name is Autumn and I am a Kenneth's Matron of Honor. From all the sporting events, making the dreaded move from Hickman to battle, Young Life, and all the senior year festivities, we shared so many firsts together. We went to our first party junior year, where we got Sonic slushies instead of alcohol. She always puts others ahead of herself, no matter what that means for her. Now Brent. When McKenna first told me about you, I was a little skeptical. Was there really a guy out there that made her this happy? Made her smile so much? Made her this excited for the future? Turns out, there is. You both complement each other so well. Brant, you bring out McKenna's smile, her giddiness, and most importantly, her perseverance in trying to get you to add another dog to the family. McKenna, you bring out Brant's adventurous side, his lovingness, and his stubbornness when he tells you no more dogs. I am so excited to see where this life takes you both. May your love be modern enough to survive the times and old fashioned enough to last forever. Let's cheers to the moments. I'm McKenna's little sister and maid of honor. Growing up, McKenna taught me many things like how to make fun mashed potatoes and the importance of staring of staying up late to do silly things, like learning all of the Just Dance dances, our favorite being Hey Ya, of course. However, it also showed me the importance of having a best friend. We may not have always been close, even when we didn't talk as much, I knew that I always had her when I needed to rant about some idiotic boy or if I just needed to talk about life. No matter what time of day, she is always ready to give me a shoulder to cry on and will do anything she can to cheer me up. I am so happy she found someone to love her as much as Grant does. He has been amazing for her in every way and has made her the happiest I've ever seen her. And I can't thank you for that. Although, I hope he knows that that doesn't mean I'm not going to bully him. <laughs> um, as of today, you have officially become another older brother and I'm going to treat you just like I treat my other ones. I love you both greatly and I can't wait to see Judge. Judge, the special great one.